All right, back with a couple more Bratton Pures. They brought us a, a, a smorgasbord of, of, of different variety here, and, and uh, uh, they got a land race out here. He's sired by the um, – the after hours bore on a mayhem going green. Uh, Mom was the reserve land race uh, guilt for Douglas uh, World Pork Expo 2018. Uh, sister Sal raised the champion land race guilt at the Indiana State Fair for the Emmenheiser family in 2019. Uh, and it looks like Kalen's pretty excited about these after hour pigs. And uh, from the land race that I've seen, I know that boar is, is uh, going to be very, very uh, uh, relevant there. Uh, the Tamworth pig is a petting zoo. Zip zap, guess what? And I'm not going to pretend to know uh, too many uh, Tamworth pedigrees, but it uh, looks like a, a real good feeding Tamworth pig and, and uh, says here the mother of the champion Tam Barrett uh, CPS in Chickasha February show a few years back for the Stoddy crew uh, was uh, on the uh, on the top and, and Kalen talked to the depth and quality of this Tamworth litter and uh, uh, this one looks uh, very very solid for the breed. Yeah the Tamworth uh, to, to keep on there uh, I mean look present design shape and uh, very exotic and I think uh, uh, that pig feeds for for whatever you need to and he's going to be on top. Uh, he is a, uh, a fundamentally good pig, but he has some of the extras in that breed in terms of look and shape. I'd say if you're in the market for a Tam, I'd get uh, I'd get after it. He's Tam good. The uh, the 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 land race pig is one that's uh, uh, very very good in terms of his head and neck, and that's going to be a, a very good uh, crucial piece at the end uh, because he's going to keep a, a neck and head on him uh, that you like to have as a mature show bearer, uh, and he's big enough and his type and kind to take to those heavier weights. Uh, uh, if you want to show him in July or you want to show him in August, I think he's going to be one that uh, maintains that kind of look and presence with the hardness of shape. Uh, the Bratton Landrace deal is uh, hard to beat. Uh, they've, they've got them built right, bearers and gilts that feed and win at the end. That's a very good pair of pure bearers there. If you want to be competitive in either breed, I think you need to look those up.